Yo, what's good guys, Witness 2K back with another Swish pack opening right here. We got Invincible D-Wade in these packs. They're hiding, he's hiding somewhere. We got this Invincible D-Wade right here, but we also have previous released hero cards are also in these packs. I wish they were the Invincibles, but they're not. Regardless, we're diving into it. So like this video and subscribe to the channel if you are new. Nike don't pay me to tell you just do it. They pay me to show you I do it again. You already know we got to start with the two equal chance packs right here. 50,000 MT of pop. Let me see your dark matter. Let's freaking get it. We get a dark matter in the first pack. Best possible outcome right here is going to be Hero D Wade. So let's not waste any time. Let's dive into it. It's a good way to get the pack opening started. Eastern shooting 26. This is going to be Kyle Corver. I'll take it. He's going to be a sniper, no doubt about it, but. I am going to list this man as soon as possible because I want to get max MT for him. I was able to list Kyle Korver for 100,000. He was the only one. So hopefully someone actually buys that. Dark Matter, let's go. So far, while opening up Swish packs, including last week, um, the equal chance packs have only been Dark Matters for me. So that is a positive. This time, Eastern, Point Guard, 34... This is going to be Paul Pierce, <laughs> believe it or not. Believe it or not, we got a Paul Pierce that can play the point guard. Card art is hella bugging right now, but I mean, I'll take that man. Two Dark Matters in the first two packs is a massive dub. Now let's try and pull the invincible Dwayne Wade. That is the plan. I had to list Paul Pierce for only 60,000 MT. Literally, packs have been out for six minutes by the time of me recording right now. And he's already down to a 60,000 MT by it now. Like, that is nuts. And I don't think my Kyle Corver is going to sell for 100k, which which sucks, but I mean, I'll get his XP done later. We've got a pink diamond right here, Eastern Conference Center. This is going to be Chris Anderson was the pink diamond Swish card that came out. I'll take him man, you know, as XP. That is XP, and speaking of XP, I have not been grinding, but I recently, like before content came out, turned the Jets on and did a ton of XP grinding. I got Kevin Garnett, Invincible, he's done, originally owner as well, which was huge because I pulled him in my last video, that was a crazy video, sold KG for about half a million, which was a dub for sure, but I'm up to level 34 at the moment. So we're, we're getting up, we're getting there, we're getting closer to Anthony Edwards because some people already have Invincible Anthony Edwards and apparently he is pretty good. So I'm definitely looking forward to getting that card. He will be awesome, but right now, all I'm focused on is Dwayne Wade. I want Invincible D Wade. If you remember D Wade cards last year, dude, he was nuts. He was so, so good last year. So that would be, I pulled two Invincibles. Um, in my 2K22 career so far, Shaq and Kevin Garnett. So pretty, pretty good ratio, honestly, with the Invincibles. I just hope we can keep that up. But like I said, I've been super busy. That's why I haven't been uploading as much. Um, moved house. I have moved into my brand new build house, um, and we're moving into it. And that is so draining. Like, yeah, I'm not even there yet. So that goes to show I'm not even there yet because I'm getting internet hooked up and everything like that. You know, I've got to be in between two houses because I need internet obviously for this. So, But as of like, this should be my last video. My next video should be in my new house recording and things will be back to normal. I want to start streaming again more consistently um, because yeah, I just have not been able to. I haven't had the time, but even if I had the time, I just haven't had the energy. I've been super tired, but it's all good. Things are starting to calm down and also more huge news. We have a Warriors vs Celtics finals. That is honestly like the probably second matchup I wanted. I wanted the Nets to go all the way to the finals, but obviously Boston managed to sweep them. We got a diamond Shea right there. Boston obviously swept the, uh, the Nets, the only team to be swept in the playoffs, by the way. But as soon as the Celtics beat the Nets, that's when I was like, all right, I'm kind of back in the Celtics, and I still am. I don't think the Celtics are gonna win. I think the Warriors are gonna get it. Like, Steph Curry is, and, and Clay and Draymond for that matter, but mainly Steph Curry, just a different animal. 
He's a different breed, dude. So I think the Warriors will win it, but I want the Celtics to win it just because I love the Celtics young team. We get another Chris Anderson right here. I sent him to the auctions, but I love the Celtics team with Jalen Brown, Marcus Smart, Jason, like Jason Tatum, dude. Like he's played really good this whole playoffs. For someone as young as him, man, man, what a future he has. And if he can get a ring right now, you know, like at the end of this season, that's gonna be huge for his career. But like I said, I think the Warriors are gonna win it all. And if Curry, when Curry gets his fourth championship, I he I think he is you can no longer argue the point who's better, him or magic. You have to either say Steph Curry or it's a tie. I mean, what Steph Curry has done to the game is crazy. And I don't wanna, you know, piss off the old heads or anything like that, but you gotta respect Steph Curry's game, man. Like, he is crazy. He's literally about to be a four-time NBA champion. I can only, I might be wrong. Obviously the Warriors are the favorite to win it. So it's looking like Curry is going to be a four-time NBA champion. He has the record for most threes of all time. He has completely changed the game of basketball. So he deserves that respect, man. He has just, uh, if he gets his fourth ring, he has just as many as LeBron James. Obviously LeBron is different. I'm not saying Curry is better than LeBron or better than MJ or anything like that. Like LeBron's got what, four NBA champions. You know, he's got four finals MVPs as well. Like there's a lot of things that go into it. And LeBron will most probably have the scoring title. You know, the most points of all time once his career is said and done but yeah man i just had oh hold up dark matter hold up hold the phone hold the phone forget let's forget about steph curry i was starting to ramble him about him anyway dwayne wade that's who we're focused on right now is dwayne wade we got a dark matter pool very exciting but it could be an absolute dud of a dark matter that's why you guys need to like this video and subscribe to the channel to give me some good pack luck let me get my third Invincible Pool 2K. Let's go for number three. Show me the flash. Easton, shooting guard. Oh. Ah, God damn it. It is going to be another Kyle Corver, which really sucks. Um, yeah, man, I just want to see Easton, shooting guard, d -Way. Can d -Way play point guard, actually? So far, we've pulled three Dark Matters, which on paper sounds really good. Sounds really good saying that I've pulled three Dark Matters, but it's just nothing to brag about, you know? It's literally, it's literally Invincible D-Wade Hero Giannis, kinda, or bust, if I'm being honest. Hero Kobe, that isn't that, well, if, he, if he still sells for over 200K, he's still a dub. Um, but Hero Wade, I mean, Hero Giannis and Hero Kobe probably might be kinda cheap after these packs as well. I don't even know. I do not even know. We just get amateurs Jimmy Butler. You gotta give a shout out to Jimmy, man. He tries so hard. Miami tries so hard. They have for so long, but they just can't quite get there anyway. They need like LeBron, they need LeBron, they need D-Wade. The Miami Heat need D-Wade. Otherwise they just can't get all the way, can they? I feel bad, man. Jimmy, Jimmy must be so exhausted by the end of every single game. He just goes nuts. So I, you gotta respect Jimmy, man. He tries so hard. Number 99, this is gonna be uh, George Mikan. George Mikan was one of the Galaxy Opals we got today. Is he shooting guard center? Why are these, why are these cards out of position? Like, I do not understand the correlation to switch to out of position. They're so random. I mean, I don't blame 2K. Like the amount of cards that we have that are, you know, out of position and cheesy and just freaking hard to deal with. You got you got to have some of these budget versions, man, just to help some people out, especially when it comes to defending some of these cheesy cards. But I would really like to see one more Dark Matter pool because I got a feeling it's going to be Wade. If I'm being totally honest, I think it might be Dwayne Wade. So if I can get another Dark Matter pool, I'd like to leave 200 MT on the account. Um, so we're going to open up another 130 should get us about 13 more packs. That is a very decent amount. We could honestly get like two Dark Matters in that amount of packs. So let's make it happen, 2K. We get a Diamond Coach, Tyron Lou. Coaches are actually so rare, but for some reason, I've, I've been pulling them lately. Have you guys been pulling coaches more often in your packs lately? Like, like I mean, Amethyst and above, of course. 
So let me know if, you, if that for some reason has been happening to you guys lately. We've only got like seven, maybe eight more packs left. D Wade, The Flash, make an appearance, dude. Make an appearance. We get Dennis Schroeder right there, which I've seen all over Twitter. Has a massive Celtics tattoo on his leg or something like that, which, man, is a bold move, man. I and mean, he got traded or something like that as well. So that is, that is rough. I'd be getting that lasered. We get another pink diamond Chris Anderson. I think that's the third, maybe fourth time of pulling that card. We have the final pack right here. What's it going to be? D-Wade, are you going to bless up real quick? Bless this pack. I'm going to leave it at that. Three Dark Matter pulls ain't terrible. Um, could have been a lot better. Obviously, those Dark Matters are nothing to brag about, but I'm going to leave it at that. I have experience with pulling Invincibles, and I know when to stop. But I hope you guys did enjoy this Switch pack opening video. Like the video right now. Subscribe to the channel if you're new, and I'll catch you all in the next upload. It's been witnessed. Just play you, man, I had to switch it up Yeah, I might lose a few, ask me if I give a fuck Hey, just play you, man, I had to switch it up Yeah, I might lose a few, ask me if I give a fuck